Hello folks. Do you think that the sun is a viable source for cooking? People have tried all sorts of solar cookers over the years. Uh, today we're going to assemble this sole source solar cooker by One Earth Designs. We're going to see how easy it is to assemble. We're going to see how well it cooks and you'll be able to see for yourself whether or not a solar cooker is right for you. See what kind of parts we have here.
the person using it gets to stand in here. That's the beauty of this design. And it's this is really it's like being on the oven as long as you have a sunny day. This is like being right in front of your stove. It's hot. I'm going to let the hot dogs put a little grease in the pan, then I'm going to add some eggs. We're going to be cooking in uh, 10 minutes, or eating in 10 minutes. Cut them up so everybody has a little bit. And so this is, this is smaller, this pan, so this has to be right in the middle, but a cast iron works well because the black absorbs the heat. I mean, look at that. That's amazing. So what'd you think of that, folks? I thought this cooked really well and quickly. Uh, it's an easy design to put together and um, it cooked up quick as if we were on top of the stove. You saw the smoke coming off right away. So. There are many solar cookers out there. This one is Soul Source by One Earth Design. I like it, I think it's a really great design. Um, some of the others that we've used uh, are manufactured in different parts of the world, but at the School of Self-Reliance, we also show how to make a low-cost solar cooker using only a box within a box and a glass lid. So there are many options depending on your income level and the, the budget that you have to, uh, to spend on these sorts of things. So if you have questions or comments, please contact us through the School of Self-Reliance.